Welcome to Techno Learning. This is part eight, and we are now going to make changes in main activity. Also, we haven't touched the main activity yet. So, first of all, add up all the resources that are present in the main activity. I think two buttons and uh, one view flipper is there. So, we are adding it, and you can see that uh, I think there is some short of mistake. I have added the about section too. Okay, I'll be adding in the upcoming videos if they will be possible. Did he? Now, in the on create method, I am getting the full screen. For getting the full screen on the phone, I am getting uh, this method and setting this method as flag flag underscore full screen dot uh, yeah. So for getting the full screen on this, uh, you can go for the changes into the styles if you want to get this setting from there. There's no sort of uh, mistakes there also, but I think this is the best way. In the one line, you will be able to get the full screen on your device. So yeah, it is set it, and now I have to add up some more properties like set content view as r dot layout dot activity main as i think uh, this value is also uh, repeated but don't worry this will not cause any error it will be okay uh, let me add some find view by id just matching the xml and java file variables for the two buttons and now setting the on click listener for the button encryption this will get get the user into the encryption activity that is encoder and within this button you have to set up the intent to call the second activity or to start the second activity so here i am making the intent okay first of all click on alt enter to import the intent package into the class so now you can just write main activity dot this and then the class name that is encoder sorry the e is capital in this case i made a mistake e is capital okay perfectly fine now we'll set up the on click listener for the second button first of all we'll just okay yeah so first of all just set up the set on click listener for the second button then we'll be starting the activities at the same time we'll be add up that start activity uh, option same let me match these parentheses and braces okay yeah there was some error while implementing this I have to implement it again yeah no there, there was not uh, an error uh, I'm just uh, undoing it wait it is showing some error right now is it okay I, I just forgot to implement the method on click method I'm very very sorry and here I have to make that intent call so intent temp alt enter to import this intent package then we are making the new intent and getting the main activity dot this and going into the encoder dot class so it is perfectly fine now for the second button don't worry we'll start the activity while we uh, set up this uh, decryption button first on click listener so here we have to set up the decryption set on click listener as it is same as of the encryption as we have done it in the above part implement that uh, method by clicking on clicking on that red bulb make that intent temp and just do the same thing as we have done in the above part but make sure the class name is different here it is decoder class and now we are going to start this activity by using 
start activity here pass this stamp also uh, in the previous one we have forgot to add the start activity yeah add it here it is of temp yeah it is good now you can see that we have to remove this extra space there is lot of extra space and okay first of all uh, we have to set up that uh, view pager that we uh, set it up for that animation kind of thing banner the image will come and go there's a kind of thing so we are getting that we have as view flipper property and giving the image for this flipper from the drawable resources uh, we have just uh, in the first video or the second video we have copied all the resources into drawable these images were also the part of that remember that if you are getting an error here that's mean you didn't have uh, copied that resources so here we are making the loop for the number of images present in the image loop Im image array and here we are going to use a flipper function that we are going to implement uh, outside this loop uh, we'll make up the flipper function and for the flipper function i'm just removing the extra space and checking the braces yeah and the correct space uh, making the flipper function here for just showing the error into that uh, view flipper as banner changing the images uh, at a time span here i'm making the image view text and passing the context as this and by using this text we will be set up that image in the background resources and giving the value of images and after this we have to give the add view as test and then we have to give the flip interval time i am giving the 3 seconds that is 3000 milliseconds and now i have to give the auto start to make it true so that whenever the image is and it starts from the beginning so that at the end you have to give the set in animation for this and giving the android dot r dot n dot slide left so all the images will be slide into left in the view flipper banner so we have to add up uh, this for set out animation also and we'll be sliding it into the left so we'll add up the slide right and make sure it is out not in yeah it is out so here all the things are completed right now from the main function side remove this extra space make sure the braces okay so thank you for watching this video you can subscribe us